You know, a lot of Ted's uh, people problems was due to jealousy. For Ted's entire life, Ted had uh, quite a few different, uh, you know, when he was younger girls and young females and young ladies interested in Ted, and there was a lot of competition. There was a lot of competition between the, the uh, females of that gender and also with the males and that gender to um, knock down true love and loyalty that other people would be interested in Ted. And that happened all over the place with all kinds of people Ted went to school with and grew up with. Therefore, a lot of the problems Ted experienced with people was jealousy. And Ted, about the time he hit uh, seventh grade, started looking very attractive and was tall, very attractive, had a really good complexion. Um, they all liked his eyes and his face and his look and how he talked and his intelligence. His intelligence showed his potential, definitely showed, and they saw the potential. And that carried on into academy and into college or university and even in uh, dentistry. Uh, in graduate school, there was a lot of jealousy shown, you know, with uh, definitely for certain. The, the single men. And uh, therefore, a lot of this was not Ted's problem, it was just jealousy. A lot of this was jealousy. So a lot of your uh, their nemesis or enemies or problems are against Ted, just flat out jealousy. And even dentistry, Ted saw quite a bit of jealousy. It was just plain and simple jealousy. It was nothing else. Ted did not do anything to deserve it. It was jealousy. It was your jealousy. Therefore, can... Um, Humans be jealous of 100% human God, you better believe it. There's a lot out there that don't want to believe in Ted just because of their jealousy. Jealousy alone and competition. You can you peep God, certain husbands are saying, certain men are saying, certain boyfriends are saying. How can you compete with God? I have to say he's not God. I'm going to argue against him. So a lot of the men out there are arguing against Ted and trying to pull away their wives, their daughters, um, their nieces their um, family from Ted out of simple jealousy. And what are you doing? You're pulling down the floodwaters. They're going to be lost. They're going to be eternal death. They're going to be put in hell or Hades. Dream said hell, hell or Hades. Ted is not going to, you know, start pulling people onto the boat if they don't want to be in the boat or if they don't qualify. Ted is not that forgiving. He's not going to strain to pull them when they're overboard on board. Not how much you think. It's pretty obvious to some of you who Ted is, but your jealousy alone are going to get you and your entire family uh, lost and get eternal death. You're definitely um, going to be responsible, so some of you that are responsible are going to be punished more. And you're going to deserve it. 